They call it the Bone. Born from the B-1, the Rockwell B-1 Lancer is one of America's greatest aerospace achievements. Part Cold War relic, part modern war machine. It's sleek, powerful, and still flying strong decades after its debut. Today we're diving into the untold story of the B-1 Lancer, from its radical origins to its battlefield legacy, and why it remains a critical piece of U.S. air power. Welcome to Armory Unveiled, your premier destination for in-depth explorations of military technology and history. If you enjoy discovering the power behind the world's most advanced weaponry and the stories that shaped warfare, make sure to subscribe. Your support helps the channel grow and brings even more content your way. The B-1 Lancer, America's bone-crushing bomber. It's the early 1970s. The Cold War is in full swing. The US needs a bomber that can outfly Soviet defenses, fast, far, and deadly. Enter the B-1A, a sleek, high-speed marvel with swing wings and four massive engines. The B-1A could blaze past enemy radar at over Mach 2.2. Only four prototypes were ever built each equipped with variable sweep wings and enormous thrust from General Electric F-101 engines. But just as fast as it appeared, it vanished. In 1977, President Jimmy Carter canceled the program, pivoting towards stealth and cruise missiles. The B-1A, despite its raw power, was considered too easy to spot on radar. But this wasn't the end. With Ronald Reagan in office, the B-1 got a second chance, but with a twist. The B-1B was born. It gave up some speed, topping out at Mach 1.25, in exchange for stealthier design, better survivability, and massive payload. Its radar cross-section was reduced to one-tenth that of the original. Its role? Fly low, fast, and under the radar. From 1984 to 1988, 100 B-1Bs were built. With a 146-foot length, 137-foot wingspan, and a max takeoff weight of 477,000 pounds, the B-1B was a beast, yet agile enough to launch from shorter runways than the B-52. The Lancer isn't just big, it's brutal. With three internal weapons bays and a 75,000-pound payload, the Bone carries more firepower than even the B-52. It can launch JDA Miss conventional bombs, cluster munitions, GPS-guided weapons, and the stealthy AGM-158JASSM cruise missile. Though it's no longer nuclear certified, in a conventional war, it's a monster. Thanks to terrain-following radar, it can fly just 200 feet above ground at high speed through darkness, storms, and enemy fire. The B-1B's combat debut? 1998. Operation Desert Fox over Iraq. Since then, it's been everywhere. Kosovo, Afghanistan, Iraq, Syria, and more. During Operation Enduring Freedom, B-1s flew 10-hour missions, refueled mid-air, and delivered precision strikes and even providing close air support, a role once reserved for fighters. But all that action came at a cost. For nearly a decade, the bone was overworked. Up to 70% of the fleet was deployed, far beyond the typical 40% readiness target. This led to structural fatigue and aging systems. To keep it alive, the Air Force rolled out major upgrades. IBS, Integrated Battle Station, a full digital cockpit. CITS, Real-Time Diagnostics. FIDL, Advanced Data Links. And faster maintenance schedules through the BEAST program. Slashing depot time from months to just 22 days. Even today, Boeing is stress-testing entire airframes to extend the bomber's lifespan. 
Yes, 17 B1s were retired in 2021, but the fleet is far from finished. In 2022, the Air Force reactivated a stored B-1 to replace one lost to a fire. Another was damaged in a 2023 landing accident. Yet, the bone soldiers on. The future B-21 Raider may someday replace it. But for now, the B-1 is being upgraded to potentially carry hypersonic weapons and new mission profiles. From cancelled prototype, to Cold War survivor, to modern battlefield legend. The B-1 Lancer blends the payload of a B-52, the speed of an SR-71, and the persistence of a fighter jet. It's a bomber that refuses to die. Nearly 50 years after its first flight, the bone still rips through the skies, fast, powerful, and deadly. This isn't just a bomber, it's the bone, and it's not done yet. If you enjoyed this breakdown of the B-1 Lancer, hit like, subscribe, and turn on notifications for more legendary aircraft stories. Comment below, what aircraft should we cover next? <laughs>